Hey guys, I wanted to show you one of my favorite ways to do chicken last minute. Not really last minute, but last minute preparing. Um, so this morning I went out and from our deep freeze got a nice uh, chicken that was totally frozen and I wanted it for supper. And so what I have been doing now is throwing, this isn't ideal, Tony would say but I throw it in the crock pot frozen and I throw in a whole bunch of um, herbs or however I want to season it knowing that because it's frozen I can't get those seasonings really close to the meat because I can't get the skin up or anything. So what I do is I cook it most of the day and then, um, then I pull it apart and let it just kind of soak into the juices and that's where it's able to get a little bit of that flavor from what I threw in there for seasoning. So anyways, now it's evening and I need to, I want to go to bed. So I took out all the meat and it's just, I mean, it is, it literally falls off the bone. You get so much meat because you're able to really pick through every part of the bird. And so you can find little pockets of meat that you wouldn't otherwise if you were just um, eating the chicken. Then you see, I didn't add any liquid, but you can see there's quite a bit of broth and so all I'm going to do is since this is in the crock pot I just fill it up to the top with um, water and then I turn it on low and it goes all night and then the house smells <laughs> like lovely chicken broth in the morning but then you strain it off um, and you have a really beautiful chicken broth so and then you can discard your bones it's just a way to get every bit of goodness um, from your chicken I do put in just a few tablespoons of apple cider vinegar, and I have read that that pulls out, um, that helps maybe break down even more of those chicken bones to pull out more good stuff. So, super easy. It was a frozen chicken this morning. It served us for supper. Now I have leftovers for more meals, and then I have chicken broth. 